Virginia Convention to correct this deficiency, took it upon himself the task of combining the 210 amendments. Most of them were designed to protect the fundamental rights of the citizens against federal incursion. But wasn't that over a year later? Yes, that's correct, Miriam. It wasn't until a full two years later, September 1789, that Congress actually adopted a total of 12 amendments. Ten of the proposed amendments were ratified by the states. The other two were dropped completely. These original ten amendments came to be known as the Bill of Rights. Now, that didn't occur until December 1791, over two full years after Congress's original ratification. It was also at the same time that the national debt was over 50... We'll be discussing this first, so I'll see you Monday. Class dismissed. They can only hold out. And they better, because I'm sure horny. Oh, Kathy, what's the use? It never works. Either we can't get out, or they don't know what to do when we do. Hey, you guys. Wait for me. Hi, is it all set for tonight? Shh. Yes, but I didn't include you. But you kind of said I could come this time. Oh, Buffy, it's not that we don't want you. It's just that, well, you're too inexperienced for the fellas. Inexperienced? I'll have you know. Besides, isn't it that time of the month? My friend's almost gone, and by tonight it'll be all over. Oh, please. No. Now listen, next time we'll find somebody new. The boy virgin, just for you. Oh, really? I want to go. It's just something always happens. Last time I had that chemistry test, and I had to study. Well, that's too bad. You're not coming. Oh, Misty, really? Not still. Think about tonight. That's real. Boring Barrett. Yuck. Think about George. Isn't he just gorgeous? I'm not all that innocent, and I'm not a virgin. He's so intelligent, sensitive, and warm. All right, just name one boy that you've had. Well, I... I don't... Never mind. Next time, Buffy, really, we'll definitely include you. Girls, don't you have a gym class to go to? And Buffy, I'll need your help to go over those exam papers. But what about my phys ed? The team needs me. I'm free, Mr. Barrett. I can help. Thank you, Misty. But I've already told Coach Fowler that Buffy will be 20 minutes late. Come on, Buffy. Come on. I trade a hundred gorgeous Georges for one night with Barn Barrett.
didn't want to mention this in front of your friends. But you promised. I know all the answers. I just wasn't trying. You promised I wouldn't fail. You promised me. You promised me an A if I let you have my A. Buffy! Buffy! Do you know that I'll be dismissed and you'll be expelled from school if we're caught? Oh, I do. I do. Just be a little more careful. Showers. Miriam? Miriam. I, uh, I missed you last night. Thought you were anxious to pass your exams. I'm sorry, Mr. Fowler. I'll be there tonight for sure. Just that I got busy doing that. Look, it makes no difference to me, young lady. But you know you won't be on the team if you fail. And if you want my assistance, you'll be in my office by 7 o'clock. Yes, sir. Well, uh, do you think you're getting in, Marion? I don't think so, Mr. Fowler. Here, let's try it this way. Mr. Lawson says you're always so hard. And he always has such big, long tests. I just can't get it. Try 
and I try, but I just can't get it. Well, Mr. Fowler? Mr. Fowler? Mr. Fowler? Uh, that's very good, Miriam. Uh, we'll continue tomorrow at uh, 5 o'clock in my office. Yes, sir. See you tomorrow, then. This is it? This is your romantic little hideaway? This, sweetheart, is a barn. Jack? What are you doing here? Well, I just stopped by to say hello, Kathy. If you want a man, you know, I've seen him a couple of times. His eyes hanging out on some chick's rear end, especially that little Marion's ass. And from that bulge in his pants, I'd say he's built. Now there's something I'd like to see. Baller and Marion. Hey, that's it. That's it. Don't you see? We'll write a note to Fowler from Marion. Inviting him to be the one to teach her. I'm so shy. Please come to my room. All the other kids will be gone this weekend. Except for you. You'll be there. That horny man no. might just fall for it. But I don't want Fowler. I want Barrett. Oh, listen, it's hard time, sweetheart. Take what you can get. I love it. We've got nothing to lose. If he turns the note in, poor Marion. If he doesn't show, poor you. Good morning, Bethany. Good morning, Carl. Ah, 
Good morning, Buffy. Did you have a nice weekend? Oh, very nice. Thank Good. you. Good. Thank you. 